Good morning everyone and welcome back to my channel. I'm another vlog today. Today is going to be a, another follow me around day vlog. I mean that's all my daily vlogs. But today I'm gonna do a little different and gear it towards my life as like a political science student here at UCLA just to give you all a different feel of like how my major like affects what I do every day on campus. So right now I'm walking to my first class. Um, Larry's just wearing a shirt, some leggings, Nikes backpack ready. Uh, I'm standing in front of Powell and in front of Royce. So this is easily one of UCLA's most famous buildings. Absolutely gorgeous and I've definitely had some poli sci classes in here. I think two. Um, over there you have Haynes and Humanities. I've also had um, poli sci classes in there as well but I'm not going to any of those buildings today. I'm going to some farther buildings up in North Campus that way so let's go ahead and head out but just a little more about myself in case you are new to my channel I am a fourth year poli sci student so I've been poli sci for four years um, I'm a junior transfer so I actually spent my first years at UCSD as a poli sci major and then I transferred here so I've been poli sci for a long time got like a taste of um, like UCSD poli sci and UCLA but if you have any questions about that specifically, feel free to comment down below. Um, no, I'm not trying to go to law school or anything like that. I just happen to be really passionate about poli sci. Um, I'm just very interested in it. I do want to pursue a, like, a career in business, but I mean, poli sci is great. Like I've learned so much through it. And with college, you definitely find out that it's more, you learn a lot outside of the classroom as well. So that's where I'm getting like my business experience. But all right, so let's head throughout campus and head to my first class. Continuing through campus, and ju just so you all know, it is a Tuesday, so a lot of my poly classes I try to like put on Tuesdays and Thursdays, so I only have lecture two times a week instead of like Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Um, here we have a cute little quad, this is one of our sunken gardens, it's a little like area that kind of sinks in if you can see. But alright, so we're heading up here, and at UCLA we have four main concentrations. When it comes to poli sci, we have American, which that's what I am. I'm um, poli sci with American concentrations, so that's like American politics. We have comparative politics, international relations, and then um, political theory. So the class I'm going to right now is actually a political theory class, and it's like a 20th century philosophy. So it's kind of like a philosophy and theory class in one. It's rough. <laughs> Uh, since my concentration is American politics, I don't really favor or do well with political theory, but it is a required class um, that I take two political theory classes for my major, so just gonna bear with it. But, okay, so we're coming up this building. It's called Bunch, and it's basically, it's a little covered right now by some trees, but as you can see, it's this one right here, and it's actually um, like the main poli sci building, and what that means is like a lot of professors have offices here, a lot of TAs have offices here, and then what else? Oh, there's like the poli sci department, so it has like, uh, if you need like counseling for your major or you need anything else, or there's like, you know, changing classes or like internships and stuff, all that information is going to be in this building right here. We call it the Waffle Iron Building because it kind of looks like a waffle iron. All right, so let's continue. My class is back that way in the building next to it. Okay, so here we are. This is where my first class is for the day. It's um, just, we call it public affairs. Um, it's one of the farthest buildings on campus, which kind of sucks, because like, it takes like 20 minutes to walk here. So, sad in the morning, uphill, kind of sucks. Right, so this class is like a lecture. I actually only have lectures this quarter, which is pretty cool, but usually like a poly's class will have like lecture. Hi, oh hi. Oh, cool. <laughs> Um, love meeting infinities, but okay, so this class is a lecture and it's different from like what I usually have which is like lecture and discussion with like a TA, but all my classes this quarter are all just lectures. So we're heading upstairs and this is a smaller lecture. I've had lectures where I've had like close to 300 people in it or like 200 people. This one probably has maybe 100, a little, a little less, maybe 70, but all right, let's go. All right, so I'm inside my lecture now. Again, it is really smaller, just lecture style. Um, but okay, so I will go ahead and vlog after class, give you all updates about my day. Hey everyone, so I finished with that poly class, learned about more Marcuse's philosophy and his Freud theories and all that good stuff. But I'm heading to my sorority house to get some lunch and then I'm gonna head out again. I've worked a little bit. Um, it's so exciting because it's kind of like for most of the houses on the row, it's like a big little week. So there's like a lot of girls like picking up their gifts and I hope that my little um, is liking all the gifts that she's getting so far. And I'm gonna have a whole vlog coming up later this week about that. I can't like upload that now because then she's gonna know who I am, but that's coming very, very shortly. But yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and get some lunch right now and then head out to work. 
And here we are approaching my lovely sorority house. Delt Gamma, so let's go ahead and I think today we have grilled cheeses for lunch, so let's go. Alright, so this is what I'm having for lunch. We have some grilled cheeses, some tomato soup, and some fresh fruit. Now, I never like ate tomato soup growing up, so like I had it, I think like, or like tomato soup and like grilled cheese like together. I didn't have it until like moved into the sorority house when I like chef started making it, and now I'm kind of like obsessed and I look forward to like grilled cheese and tomato soup because I never had like this combination growing up. Um, but yeah, super delicious. Yeah. So update, it's 3.40 and I just finished with work. I worked for about like two and a half hours um, for Eastlake Media Team. I was doing some like cutting like work and writing some blog posts for our Facebook page. And now I'm heading to my second and last class of the day. It is longer, it is um, two hours. It's a two hour lecture, not as big as, actually no, this lecture is bigger than the other one. Um, the one I had this morning and this class is about Congress so obviously I really really enjoy this class because it's in my field of expertise my field of study that I like I chose to concentrate in so let's go ahead and head in all right so I'm in my lecture now and just to give you all a feel for like the lecture size of this classroom it is a lot smaller or like the normal ones but it is larger than like the one I showed you this morning um yeah they're pretty early but okay, I'm gonna go ahead and have my class and I'll go ahead and vlog after. So update, it's 8.30 and I'm at work. Um, I just finished covering an event which is really, really fun. So I'm here just uploading stuff on that computer and I just finished uploading stuff on this computer. But yeah, um, I got to meet like four infinities at the so like, major blast, which is really awesome. I didn't have my vlog camera with me since I was working. I had like the DSLR, I was like taking photos and stuff, but I couldn't vlog, so I'm sorry. But uh, it was so nice meeting all of you. And look at this friend I have. She's so cute. Look at this. Look at this. So I was covering the event, and there's like a balloon um, artist guy, like balloon animal guy. And I was like, put on. He's like, wait, wait, hold out your wrist. And I was like, okay. And then he like gave me this. So happy. But okay, yeah. So I'm finishing up here, and then once I'm done, I'm gonna head out, head to Kelvin's, and we're gonna have dinner. So yeah, like then. All right. So it's dinner time here at Kelvin at his place. Yeah, Shelly now. <laughs> so we made steak and some salad. So I really, really like Caesar dressing with some, what steak is this? Sirloin. Sirloin. I've never done this before. Um, but I did marinate it, so yeah. Yummy marinade. Cool. I'm going to watch some Parks and Rec and have dinner. All right, everyone. So it's 1.30 in the morning. I took a little nap after dinner. I literally just fell asleep. I was so tired from the day. It's been a long day. Um, but now up and doing homework. Basically what I'm doing is doing a lot of reading, so I have like this article to get through, and then another article to get through, and then another article to get through. So being a poli-sci major, literally all the time, depends on the class of course, but majority of the time it's just a lot of reading, um, sometimes some reading quizzes, but like that's about it. I really, rarely ever have homework, it's just reading, and then we have your midterms, finals, and papers. But uh, yeah, so I hope that this video was really helpful for anyone who is considering doing poli-sci or interested in what the life is of a poli-sci major at UCLA. But thank you all so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed, and I will talk to you all tomorrow. Bye. Mwah.